So, this is League of Legends. It's free. First impressions. This is a free game and by far the best free Let's game I've saw. ever played. Um, oh shit. I used the wrong first ability. God damn it. Oh well. Off to a bad start. So what are you doing? Um, There's so. The store. This yeah. is You're a, at the store. I'm at the store. As oh, you wish. That asshole's going in the middle. All right. Um, this Welcome is a game that is based game. off of what was originally a Warcraft 3 mod called Dota, or Defense of the Ancients. Yeah. And I don't know if there's really a good name for this genre yet, but uh, what I've seen a lot of people call it is just uh, an action Only RTS. Yeah. And um, you've played this genre too. It's like a hero. <clears throat> Right, but instead of Game. controlling a whole army, you're yeah, controlling one hero, and every fun. hero has four abilities um, that are mapped to Q, W, E, R, queer, on the keyboard. Mm -hmm. And um, uh, and then you start at level one, and you get money, and you buy items as you kill creeps, and you kill people on the other team. So th this is a five-on-five -five game. Creeps are just, um, like, mm -hmm. enemies... In and, the environment. Right, and I'll try to Oh, someone disconnected. just disconnected on the other team. Um, uh, yeah, and you'll see in a second there's like uh, creeps, which are basically the um, food. food that you kill to get money and you um, get experience from killing. Um, and you use that money to buy items to make your character stronger and to level up your abilities and all that kind of stuff. So you played um, Sotus, which is a StarCraft II custom game type. Storm of the Imperial Sanctum. Mm-hmm. And it's and exactly the same as this. It's almost identical. But they're StarCraft the characters. Story. Right, instead of... These weird guys. Yep. And um, so this other dude that's right next to me with the green health bar, he's on my team. In a flash. And... Uh, Oh, also in addition to that, there is these turrets, and that's kind of the objective of the game, is to take out basically all their turrets and take out their nexus, which is like way behind their base. Understood. And um, uh, I think the max level on this is 18. Mm -hmm. Oh, so we I mentioned really before how this is free to play, right? As you yeah. wish. Um, there are things you can pay for in this. Oh, that motherfucker keeps getting all the last shots and getting all the money. He's good at that. Um. As you wish. Uh, so yeah, this game is free to play. Um, there's a lot of different things you can buy though. Like you can buy new skins for all the different characters. Um, you can Those buy the gameplay. No. Um, but you can also, so every week, they give you 10 free-to-play characters. Um, and nothing that is... Only for you. Uh, that is charged for, or no, no, no. Nothing that affects the game... Costs can, money. Costs money only. Um, the, there are a few things that you can only buy with money, and those are like skins for the characters only to make your character you. look different. Um, and things like... IP bonus, IP bonuses, which are called, which are influence points, which is what you earn from playing games, and what you can spend on um, In a flash. Uh, new characters. Like right now, I'm this ice bird person, mm -hmm. right? And um, uh, <laughs> he's one of the, or she's one of the free to play characters this week. Uh -huh. And normally, it's like Ooh. I think 3,500 IP points to uh -huh. buy her. And um, uh, I, I've played this quite a bit in the last week or so, and there is no way I will have been able to afford her Understood. without um, buying her. Mm -hmm. So 3,500 is quite a bit. So um, do the controls, are they like StarCraft, or you have to use the edges of the Let's screen? Go. Yes, they are just like StarCraft. They don't, they're not as smooth. Like in StarCraft, I like to use the middle mouse, yeah. but it's inverted, or it's not oh. inverted, so it's practically impossible for me to use. I see. So I, I never use that, really. Um, 
so that was one of my abilities right there. Um, I guess I'll talk about like this character specifically because that's who I'm using. And like every character has their own unique abilities. Um, and there's like ranked games and stuff like that too, where if you want to, like there's like, a ladder and stuff like that. Um, so that ability is called Flash Frost. And anything that it hits as it's moving, it does uh, 90 damage to it. And it's level 2 for me right now. Um, it does 90, 90 damage to it. And then when I hit Q a second time, it explodes and does an additional 90 damage and stuns anything that it hits. So I'm going to keep trying to hit this dude and stun him. And now my next ability that I just used on him was called Frostbite. And because I hit him with the Flash Frost, he was chilled. Mm -hmm. And then when, when I, um, and then my next thing does uh, double damage to anybody that's chilled. So it, it, it kind of like stacks. And basically I'm just trying to do damage to him to make him go back to the home base and heal. So there's a, a, a pool? Yeah. Yep, so like if you get really low on health, you can go back to the main um, area where I started, which is, oh, so like, you can see this game's kind of split into two quadrants. Uh, there's like a top right and um, a bottom left, and like, there's three lanes, which is what they're called. And um, the three lanes are where the different... Oh, come on, get him! Oh, damn it, I almost got that guy. But I can't, like, because it's so early on in the game, Oh my god, that guy's gonna fucking die. Idiot. I just gotta kill him. And what? Do you get money for getting kills? Yep. You get money for getting kills. And that guy's an idiot. He's gonna die. Oh, well, I got an assist for that, so that's not too bad. Do you get money for getting an assist? Yes, you get money for getting assists. Oh, actually, no, I'm not sure about that, but you do get money for getting kills. Do you get experience for assists? Uh, I'm not really sure. I'm still learning a lot about this game. In SOTUS, the StarCraft 2 mod, you do get money, but I don't know, there's a lot of intricate things about this game that I'm still learning. So what makes this stand out above StarCraft version? Okay, so what is significantly different about this than the StarCraft version is that there are 80 characters in this game. Mm -hmm. And it's significantly more balanced, I think. Like, there's not a, there's no characters that just absolutely dominate constantly. Mm -hmm. Like, um, well, who's that guy that I used? The cow. Um, <laughs> yeah. Oh, shit, what was his name? Uh, T-Bone. Chuck T-Bone. Chuck T-Bone. Oh, and you cool. get money for killing the towers. Um, everybody on the team gets money for killing the towers. There's also a couple, like, bosses spread out across the level that everybody on the team gets money for killing. Uh, but when you kill a person, you get money for that. And when you kill the creeps, you get money for that too. And, and, and the creeps are just like, I don't know. It's it's a very interesting game type, and it's hard to explain if you've never played it, but it's extremely fun. As you um, how, how else would you explain this? Like, what, what am I not doing a good job of explaining right now, other than everything? Well, you, you look at this and you're like, what the fuck is going on? Mm -hmm. So that right there, that spell that I just used, the little circle, that was my ultimate. And uh, this character's ultimate's kind of unique in that I can use it extremely frequently. It has like a five second cooldown. Mm -hmm. Most characters' ultimates are like once every two minutes. Let's but mine, um, it just damages everything in that circle um, uh, every second. And I can use it a lot, but it uses a lot of mana. Yeah. So it's it's got the typical health and mana system that a lot of Only RPGs have. So right now I'm level seven and that fucker's level three. Oh, so every character has a, a heroic passive too, is what they're called. Understood. And mine is when I die, I turn into an egg that has the exact same health that I have, oh. and and they have to kill me a second time basically. That's weird. And it takes <laughs> a, uh, like five minutes to recharge, so I can't just constantly die and keep. Um, like turning into an egg and... Oh, I need to go back and spend some money. Damn. Dude, yeah, because like, when you first start playing one of these games... Mm -hmm. You will suck. You have no idea what's going time. on. 
You're like, how did I just die? What's going on? Yeah. What's the store for? How do I use the store? <laughs> oh, yeah. The how store, do I uh, heal? Okay. So I, I hit B, and that recalls me. As long as I don't get hit by anybody or I don't move or anything, um, it instantly teleports me back to home. Did you have to pay for that? Nope. That's just everybody gets that. As you wish. So right now I'm going to buy the boots, which make me move faster. And I'm going to buy... Oh, damn it. I'm... 100 money short, 100 gold short of being able to afford that next item. Oh well. So in this game, unlike so, I'm, I, I guess I'll keep talking about sodas because that's what you know. You get two spells as well, and you can choose those um, uh, before the game starts. And I chose teleport and heal. Um, mainly because my character is actually pretty weak. He does a ton of damage very quickly, Understood. but he's actually like very easy to kill. Mm hmm. Um, doesn't have a lot of health. Um, so I, yeah, I, I just use teleport, which takes three minutes to recharge. How is the um, party of people you know? It's not great. Uh, it's okay. It's not. Whoa, this guy's a fucking dumbass. He's gonna die. Only for you. And you can hide in the trees. It's like a hiding in the trees. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah. So it has kind of a different system. Oh my God, get him! Uh, Damn it. Yeah, so um, this game has what's called the brush. Mm -hmm. And like right now you see I'm kind of translucent. Mm -hmm. Nobody can see me unless they're also in the brush nice. or they use an ability that can like scan kind of thing. Is there a lot of uh, characters that cloak? No, there are not a lot of characters that cloak like in StarCraft. Um, and it seems that, like it's taking a long ass time for you to kill this turret. This game is a lot more team based. And it's much... So in Sodus, you can easily get fed. Yeah. You know, where like, one character just gets so strong that they absolutely dominate the game. And that can happen in this, but not nearly as much to the degree that the StarCraft version does. So let's see, oh, I got a thousand gold, I'm gonna go back and spend that. But you'd think... Oh. Hmm. Isn't no, no, that keep, fun to be uh, overpowered, keep, though? Keep asking questions, because, well, it, it turns out it is. Oh, well, of course it's fun to be overpowered <laughs> like that. But um, uh, it results in much more balanced games. Mm -hmm. So this, uh, this next item that I'm working towards, it gives me 20 ability power, which makes my magic attacks do more damage. But it's got um, a, a lot of items that you buy. Uh, can build up and get stronger over time, like this one. Um, it gives me eight ability power per stack, and I get two stacks for a kill or one stack for an assist. And I, and I can stack up to 20 times, so I can get an extra 160 ability power at 20 stacks. Mm -hmm. And um, at 20 stacks as well, uh, the, the cooldown rate on my abilities drops so I can use them a lot faster yeah so I mean that's like that's the kind of complicated shit that makes this game not beginner friendly at you. all you know yeah um, but when you get a hang of it it's incredibly fun like <laughs> amazingly fun like one of the best games you love this game like oh As these game wish. types are so incredibly addictive it's unbelievable <laughs> um, oh, especially this game I, I haven't talked about this at all but um there's like a passive leveling up system. Oh, there's a fight going on in the middle. I need to help out my teammates. Um, where you can level up your summoner. Or, okay, your summoner is you. Mm -hmm. Okay, and this person that I'm playing as right now is the champion, or my champion. Let's and you can level up your summoner and get new. Oh, shit. Ah. Understood. So I'm trying to kill this guy. Oh, he teleported so far out. <laughs> oh man. In a flash. So um, yeah, and I'll I'll talk about that in the second half of this and show like what leveling up your summoner does, and um, like the runes that you can use and um, the skill points you get to use to make your character stronger and really. Uh, really customize your people. And 
The trickiest part about this game for me so far is that there's 80 fucking characters and they're, it's hard to learn them all because there's so many of them and I, I don't know any of their abilities, I don't know what to look out for. Right. You know? Um, oh shit, fight going on down there. So in the StarCraft version there's probably 12 characters? Um, 20? Yeah, there's maybe like 20. And, and they keep adding new characters to this too, which is fun. But in StarCraft, you it's easy to know everyone's ability. Mm -hmm. So you're like, uh-oh, this guy's got this charged mm -hmm. up. I need to stay away from it. But in this, there's 80, and I can't even play them all. Yeah. Oh, that was a perfect shot. Oh, that asshole stole my kill. So that's a common thing that happens in... These games. These games. It's fucking kill stealing. And because getting kills are so important in this, it's like a real asshole move. Like I did most of the damage to that guy, but he got the last hit. And that's you know, that that's just one of the parts of this game. So I was I was talking earlier on about how that other dude was getting all the last hits. Uh -huh. um, if you get the last Understood. hit on a creep, you get the money for killing that creep. Uh -huh. So you have to like what I'll do sometimes is I'll just kind of like walk back and forth and wait till the creep has very low health mm -hmm. and then just get that last shot, which is what everybody basically does. Um, so I got my teleport skill ready again. Where should I go? Are there side stores? There are no side stores. Are there consumable items? There are consumables. Uh, basically the exact same that the StarCraft version has. Like almost identical. Is there a chrono elixir? Uh, there is one that gives you uh, stealth detection. It doesn't give you faster time scale. Well, there there is no time scale in this game. Oh. Um, so we are absolutely dominating. Um, one nice thing. Oh, so they're short a guy. Um, he's never even played. He's level one. So that's one of the reasons we're winning pretty handedly. Ooh. Fight going on in the middle. So, I was talking before about how this game is so much more team-oriented. Um, uh, there's a couple phases to this game. What people typically call phases to this. There's the laning phase, which is like, you know, the first five or six levels when you're first getting all your abilities and getting your basic items. And then there is the ganking phase, which is right after that, when everybody's running around trying to sneak up behind people and get easy kills. And then there's the team fight phase, which is when everybody's like in one huge battle all the time. Like right now, I, I, yeah. Like right now, I think we kind of skipped the ganking phase because, well, we're winning 11 to two, so maybe I just wasn't ganking. But oh shit, oh, this guy's fucking bone. Yeah. So my my, my character's third ability is that ice wall. That prevents him from whoa. So that's that dude's ability. They do damage when they hit the ground, I think, and then I think they detonate as well. Yeah, this is batshit crazy to watch. Yeah, even though I know exactly like what's you can going on. understand the concept of the game. You just yeah. don't. Uh, um, so I, I guess I'll talk about some of the other small things. Like um, there's a couple. There are these neutral Enough creeps spread around, spread around the map in what's called the jungle. Um, and I can kill these guys for some easy gold. Um, this is my ultimate on them. And then there's also Let's these... Soar. I think right here is the golem. Yeah, and he's got that blue circle around him. And when I kill him, I get faster mana regeneration and uh, faster cooldown on my abilities. Mm -hmm. So I don't have to wait as long. So I'm gonna... Uh, I wonder if I'll be able to kill him. I don't think I will, with the amount of mana that I have. Oh, I only need 300 more gold for my next <laughs> item. Fuck. Like, it's, uh, this game, ooh. You gonna be able to gank? Oh, oh god. Oh, shit. oh, I'm an egg. Oh god. So I turned into an egg, and they're gonna have to kill me really fast. I'm alive, I'm gonna die again. Yeah, I'm fucking bummed. Only for you. Is that your teammate? Oh god. Yeah, my teammates came into school. I shouldn't have been out there by myself. Cause I mean, like that's the thing, even though we're dominating this game, mm -hmm. unlike in Sodas, you really have to work together when you get to a higher level. Like you can't uh, can't be out there by yourself. That was just me being 
thing you can buy when you're dead. That's nice. Which is nice. <laughs> like, there's a lot of things about SOTUS that are just uh, kind of weird quirks. Like, if it wasn't a mod, mm -hmm. they could probably control a lot more of the stuff mm -hmm. and make it better. Mm -hmm. That's but it's true. a fucking StarCraft it's mod. It's a StarCraft mod. <laughs> and this is free, and they're making a good amount of money That's off so of it. Hard. Yeah. So I was talking about um, that blue golem. There's also one on my side of the map. And then up here on... So that there's this mini-map in the right-hand corner that I haven't talked about at all. Right here, there is a red lizard. And he... If you kill him, your attacks uh, slow down the enemy. Hmm. So I'm gonna kill... Oh, wish. they... What? That's annoying. Hmm. Someone killed a blue golem on our side, but didn't kill the little enemies that were with him, mm -hmm. so he never respawned. Oh, mm -hmm. So I might have just been waiting there for a long ass time. Hmm. How am I doing this game? Seems like you move One, slower two, too. Well, this character is very slow. Oh. But yes, it, it's definitely a slightly more yeah. slow paced game than um, so which is incredibly fast at times. It, it also, like in the team fights, you know, the problem of just like completely losing track of what the fuck's going on, mm -hmm. that still happens. In this. Can you like, lose control of your character? No, you cannot lose control of your character, which is a huge nice thing. Oh, this bitch is dead. Oh, oh. <laughs> so she's running that way. Oh, she's dead. All right. Oh, this fucker's dead too. This guy's way on the level, but... God! Yeah, I guess there's four people shooting at that guy. I, I can't complain about a kill steal there. Oh, and so you might as just notice a little ping on the map. Um, if you press the G button, just like one of those nice little um, tweaks that this game has that Sodus doesn't, you just hit G, and I can click people, and that pings the mini-map for anybody. That's nice. Yeah, so... Um, Do you get uh, money or experience for killing turrets? Uh, everybody on the team gets money. I don't know about experience. I'm gonna go home, buy my next item, and then go try to kill that lizard. Or that, <laughs> that uh, golem. So, I, I know we're doing a terrible job of explaining it. <laughs> well, you can't explain it, you have to play it. You have to play it, and you will die a lot, but it's fun as shit. This bitch wants to fight. <laughs> yeah, I'm still making up nicknames for everybody, which is As fun. You wish. Like I'm watching this, mm -hmm. and I really want to play Sodas. Yeah, I'm done with Sodas. <laughs> the the one shitty thing about this game is that um, their servers aren't great. Like I've had problems connecting to the game. Like yesterday when I was trying to play. Um, Sometimes you just can't connect, like their servers are down. Sometimes there's a wait list. Like, uh, it said, oh fuck, I'm not paying attention. Understood. Why is that guy on our side of the map? They are down a lot. Oh, he fucking stunned me and I couldn't... As you wish. Set off the second half of my ability. Oh, he's done. Understood. Anyway, um, I keep losing track because, like, what, what I'm talking about, because battles keep going on. You know. Oh yeah, server waitlist. So, um, I was playing yesterday, and uh, the wait, the wait, my position in line was over nine thousand. Took me like ten minutes just waiting. <laughs> like that, that's exactly what it said. Over nine thousand. That's it crazy. Was my position in line. Um, yeah, so it's strange like that, but for a free game, this shit's incredibly addictive. And I'll, I'll go into it later about what you can not spend money on. Is this worth it? Um, it depends on... Uh, that's completely up to you. I mean, if you want to try new characters, yeah, it's it will take a long time to buy all 80 characters. Like, fucking forever. 
Like, you won't be able... I, uh, you'll be playing this game for years if you want to <laughs> buy all 80 characters, is what it comes down to. Do you lose money when you die? Um, I don't know. <laughs> That's a huge deal. I think you do, but I'm not 100% sure. I don't know how you can not know that. Well, Understood. should I find out? Yeah. Okay. So... I don't want to die. <laughs> All right, well, don't find out then. All right. Well, I'll find out some other time. Just ask someone in chat. Do you lose money when you die? Oh, yeah, and you get bonuses. Like, that person just got a 400 or 399 gold bonus Amazing. for ending someone's killing spree. Honestly, I've never noticed. How does LOL. it matter so much in sodas? Oh, yeah. If you do, it's not nearly as big of a deal. That's all I know. Let's soar. An ally has been slain. Oh, in Shut down. Hmm. Oh. I just missed a huge team fight. In a flash. So you'd recommend it for free? Yes. This game. <laughs> yeah. It's like I'm. I'm so focused on the game. Like I don't know. It's hard to talk. And also, like, another nice thing about this game, um, you get penalized when you try to quit. Well, not, not necessarily penalized, but let's say I try to end game. We, we would like to remind you that leaving games is in contradiction to the Summoner's Codes. We note that match -made games re leaving match-made games repeatedly may lead to a temporary account suspension. Hmm. So you can get banned from playing the game for a As while you if you keep leaving, which is awesome, because one of the biggest problems of SOTUS is getting, like, an actual 5-on-5 five -five game. Mm -hmm. And if you get disconnected, like yesterday, uh, the power went out briefly. You can reconnect it again. Mm, so that's awesome. I was. It, it took me like five minutes, but I got disconnected as soon as the game started. Uh huh. So I didn't lose a ton of progress. That's I, nice. Yeah. Like there, there's a lot of nice little tweaks about this game compared to mm -hmm. the StarCraft II mod. But Let's I mean, soar. and oh, I was reading up on this a little bit actually. The um, uh, the guys who created this were some of the original. Dota creators, so it's not like they're just completely ripping them off, you know? Mm -hmm. So Dota 2 oh. is supposed to be being made. Mm -hmm. Coming out soon-ish. Oh! Oh, I got the kill. You see that wall I put up to prevent her from running away? Yeah. That was a money wall. You learned with the toilet. Yep, I learned with the fucking toilet. Do the towers get progressively harder? Um... So much I don't know. Hey, I got the last hit on that turret. I think I get a gold bonus for getting the last hit on that turret. Is that the next turret there? No, that is... Okay, so, um, do you remember in Sotus how if you kill some of those buildings... Oh, yeah. You get, they spawn bigger minions? Yeah. These are called inhibitors now. So, now that we're pushing into their base... Oh my god, this is a... Like I can't even believe how close this is to Sodus. Yeah, it's strange. Like, Sodus was the first one we played, so we thought that was original. You know? Yeah. But it's exactly the same. Yeah, it. this is a complete. Uh, apparently, this is exactly like Dota as well, so it's not like this is, you know, mm -hmm. super original either. How much money do I need for my next item? 1600. Yeah, good deal. Hey, you turn it up now. Yeah. Oh, that bitch is running in. Hey! So that, I, I don't know if you saw, but very briefly, she shot like a huge arrow there. Right? Oh god, I have no energy. I gotta go back. Sorry, buddy, you're dead. Double kill. Um, she just shot a huge arrow, which is just like Moogly's um, rocket. Mm. Like, the further it hits them from, yeah. it can go across the entire map. Um, oh. Oh, he was asking for help. Yeah. Oh, well. <laughs> it's alright. Hmm. Yeah, there's so many characters. I'm really enjoying kind of, like, learning all the new things about this game compared to Sodas. Yeah. See, I've been um, on a lake with no cell phone service for two, you know, ten days. Mm -hmm. 
So uh, anything sounds good right now. <laughs> oh, this game is, dude, for free. Let's like go. paying a dollar for an iPhone game it seems like a rip off. Compared <laughs> to how good this is. But we, um, I read uh, on the App Store, free to play games mm -hmm. with purchasable items. Microtransactions like this. Make says. more than pay to play games. Hmm. And the App Store. Hmm, that makes sense. I mean, like, uh, Penny Arcade did a comic not that long ago about, like, oh, League of Legends is free to play. How much money have you spent on this game? Thousands of dollars. <laughs> Wall, bitch! Oh, man. Oh, I just raped that bitch with that wall. And I got that kill, too. Oh, that was beautiful. Perfectly cut her off. Again, that was the second time that I got her at that exact same spot. So now we're gonna get this tower. And um, because um, there's penalties for quitting in this, there's a lot more surrenders. Like um, when you know you have no chance. Right. People surrender much more readily in this game than. Sodas. Does it have to have a No, uh, four to one. That's, and the game's over. That's okay. I'm surprised they haven't surrendered yet, actually. They already said GG. But it's over in ten seconds anyway. So, uh, I'm going to show off the store now and show what is free and what you can pay for and like, how much it costs for the non-free stuff. So, thanks for watching the first half. We'll be back in just a second. I win! How did I finish? Victory!